Bonjour and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to talk about something that is pretty important if you want to look stylish in everyday life and it's going to be about accessories. How to elevate any look, a classy simple look, using accessories. As we all know, accessories can not only elevate the look but add the much needed final touch. And as my channel is more about French and Parisian chic and style, I would like to tell you how to accessorize like a true Parisian. Let's get right into it! What I learned from stylish Parisian women is that you can elevate and upgrade almost any look just by accessorizing and today I wanted to show you several tips. Let's talk about the base of all the accessories for me, which is jewelry. I like to keep it simple yet statement. In my case, with my color type, with my color of my hair and the skin, I prefer wearing golden accessories. As you can see, I'm always having, except for my wedding ring, everything else is in yellow or pink gold. That is why we're gonna start with this beautiful set by the brand that I dearly love. It's Nord Green, a super nice minimalist yet very feminine vibe. Something which we're exactly looking for as a Parisian style lover. The full golden set is crafted from recycled stainless steel and long-lasting gold plating. This model of watch is called Native. It has golden bracelet and white dial. I find both the set and the watch timeless and chic and as they are both made out of golden colored steel it will work perfectly together and can be intermixable. You can purchase the set and the watch with my personal discount that you can find in the description box just below. But if you're not a lover of gold accessories I've got you. And we are moving to one of my favorite pieces in Nord Green collection, which is this beautiful bracelet watch, as I call it. The, the name of the model is Unica. I hope I pronounced that right. The speciality of this watch is that it is a watch and a bracelet in one, which I think and I find very chic. And I think it will elevate the look even easier. This one, as you can see, is in silver. And I actually do not find it weird to pair golden jewelry together with a silver one. I know there's a lot of debating going on about it, that it is mauvais ton uh, to mix the uh, jewelry of different color, for instance, silver and gold. But I do not think it's a problem, for instance, if you do not have a very statement, for example, in this case, earrings. My earrings have a little stone in there and they're very small. I do not think that it's a problem to wear these two pieces, for instance, together. The next one I'm going to talk about is, of course, vintage hunting, which in this case is vintage jewelry. You know that I love vintage bags and I think that it gives even a more chic touch to any look. So now, as you can see, I have changed my earrings into these beauties that I found vintage, of course. And um, I do think that vintage, real vintage jewelry has better quality, it has the flair we're looking for. And even if I would pair this with just white t-shirt, jeans and a basket bag in spring, it would have that je ne sais quoi perfect French charm. The second one I'm having here, as you can see, I hope you can see this. <laughs> I will change them immediately so that you can see the difference of how it can look. This ones I would definitely wear in the evening as I find they're more, they're bigger, they're more massive. Therefore, with a beautiful evening dress, I think it will look stunning. Those I found on a flea market in Nice, so they also behold a very special memory for me. So here we have both. I think these ones are for the everyday and these ones can be worn in the evening. The next accessory I'm going to talk about is the belt. I think that it is a very important statement piece in any women's wardrobe and if you will pay attention to Parisian women looks, you will see how they play around with beautiful statement belts. In this case, I want to focus on a very special type of belts, which is a chain belt. As you can see here, that is the belt that I'm using the most in any season, winter or summer, and of course in the spring-summer season even more. I think that it adds that exact 
flair and a little sexy detail to any look. I would wear a chain belt together with jeans, uh, for instance, white t-shirt, high, high race flare jeans and the chain belt. Next up are sunglasses, something that I'm wearing all year round and I do not stop wearing sunglasses in winter either and neither do French women. Here I am not going to go into too much details because I think it's a topic apart and please let me know in the comments below if you would like me to make a video about how to choose the right shape for your face shape of sunglasses. The one thing that is the same about them is that they are vintage inspired. This one is cat eye shape and I think that is just so feminine and beautiful. I think I must have them for about two or three years now. No, I'm having them for about five years now and they are just perfect for almost any look. These ones are from Vogue Eyewear, very good quality and the price that they are offering. These ones are 70s inspired, beautiful ones. When you know your mom of a toddler, you don't sleep half of the night, this is the size of sunglasses I would go for in the morning. So vintage inspired sunglasses is a yes. Those from 70s, those from 50s. I do have face that, you know, can wear almost any type of sunglasses, like me. But if you want me to film a video apart, focusing on how to choose the right shape of sunglasses for your face shape, don't hesitate to let me know in the comments below. And the last accessory for today is silk scarf. I chose two shapes of the scarves, the most famous ones that you know, the simple one like this, also of course vintage inspired. This is one is from Zara and a more elevated option from Christian Dior. Beautiful French Riviera vibe and the name of this scarf is a tie scarf, is a skinny scarf, there are several options and I must have about five different ones like this, unfortunately not from Christian Dior all of them, but what I want to tell here is that I want to show you several options of how you can wear it and another thing is that if you want me to film another video focused on how to wear your scarves in 10 or 15 different ways because I know a lot of different ways how to pull it off then please let me know in the comments and I will for sure do that but right now we're going to focus on these two scarves and just on several ways of how to wear them of course you can always wear it around your neck in this kind of a little bit romantic Depending, you know, it depends on your neckline, if it will suit the look or not, you have to be careful with that. But what works for me, always, we have this beautiful bag. And if you want, you know, you're wearing just a white t-shirt or what I'm wearing now, and I have espadrilles or ballerinas or even sneakers, if you'd like. What I always do, I pick a bag, a statement bag, and then I put a silk scarf around it, like this. This was a very fast way of doing it, but <laughs> the result is something like that. I think it adds a very um, uh, chic detail, I would say, chic vibe to a black bag like this, which is already beautiful, but it will elevate the look. The other way of wearing that one would be to wear it, if you have short hair, for instance, like me, I also used to have the bob cut. It always worked for me. So. Here we go. Ta -da! So this is my almost every day to go look using the skinny silk scarf uh, during the spring summer season. And I think it, it works both with short hair and long hair. And of course the famous second option is just to wear it this style and I love pairing it together with the sunglasses, with the cat eye shaped sunglasses that I think finishes the look in a beautiful French Riviera vibe. I hope that this video will inspire some of you to maybe buy some 
you know, six scarves or a new pair of sunglasses and we'll show you how you can elevate your look by just accessorizing. And if you have any questions or any future video suggestions, please don't hesitate to comment it down below. Don't forget to subscribe and to watch my previous videos where I'm talking about Parisian and French chic styles and how to dress like a true Parisian. Merci beaucoup for watching. Gros bisous.